All right, uh, ladies and gentlemen, this is this is amazing. This is uh, huge for the Dry Shave Show. We got an exclusive interview with our new Prime Minister, uh, Justin Trudeau. I'm I'm blown away. It's it's. Uh, thanks so much for being here, Justin. Thanks. What uh, man? It's so congratulations. You got majority government. Uh, Canadians obviously uh, love you. So uh, what are you going to do? And what would you say the Liberal Party is to Canada? Well, I'm glad you asked that, right? Because what what it is like in Canada for a while now, it's been like you've got the Conservatives over here and you've got the NDP over there, right? And like the Conservatives are like coffee, right? And the NDP, they like tea, yeah? But not, not everybody likes tea or coffee, right? Some people like, you know... A mixture of the two, right? So what we did in the Liberal Party is we mixed tea and coffee together to make t t coffee, right? And that's the drink that we're offering and people seem to like it. Yeah, apparently they do. I never, I never had this drink, but whatever, you know, Canadians know best, I guess. Yeah, so what, you know, a, a lot of people are, you know, you're getting some hard questions and, uh, you know, here's another one for you. you get, you're going to have to come up against some difficult opposition. You know, when it comes to the parliament, the UN, what, what are you going to do, you know? What are you going to do when you have to face, uh, at, you know, adversary? Well, uh, I'm, what I'm going to do, I'm going to ask them to be nice, first of all, right? And if they're not nice, um, I'm uh, like, going to offer them a like, charity boxing match, right? And if, if that doesn't work, well, then uh, Hillary Clinton says that if she's in power, right, she'll, she'll, like, she's got my back and she'll send someone to fucking do them. Well, what you know, I've done, if she says, listen, I'm not having no one like, push you around on the playground or the, you know, I'm in the UN. I'm not having no one pushing you around. So if anybody pushes you around, Justin, starts to give you a hard time, tell me and I'll send one of my boys down and fucking smack them around a bit. Uh, okay, well, you know, Canada has a long tradition of doing that when it comes to the States. I guess there's... You know, but uh, what what happens if you know you got to come up against Vladimir Putin? Oh <laughs> no, I don't even like fucking being in the same room as that geezer. Fucking gives me the willies. Fucking scared shitless of him. And the first time I met him, right, he just looked at me and I just pissed my pants. Yeah, but this is, see, if you're going to lead this country, these are the kind of people you're going to have to be dealing with from now on, Justin. I mean, nah, not really. I'm just going to deal with like nice Caribbean countries. I don't, don't want to be dealing with any heavy people. You know, like Russians or like Saudis, any shit like that. I'm just going to deal with like nice Caribbean countries, a few South Americans that have got stable government, some nice African countries that are friendly, yeah? And the rest of the time, I'm just going to stay in and play video games. <laughs> so, yeah. Wow, that's, uh, hey man, that's, that's great. What, what are your plans, um... So what are your plans, anyway? What are your problems for Canada now that you're, you're elected? Well, I'm glad you asked that, right? Because uh, that two main things, right? National debt and nickabs. Well, That's what you're going to get out of me for the next few years, right? If you like national debt, if you want your grandchildren swimming in public debt, right? I'm your fucking boy. Right, because I'm going to spend so much money. I'm going to spend more money. I'm going to spend more money than a fucking hooker on crack. Right? And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to get on the blower to Vladimir Putin and go, Oi, mate, all them people you're killing in Syria in the fucking niqabs, stop doing it. Because we need them niqabs in Canada. Because I've got a plan to give everybody in Canada a fucking niqab. And right, and if you love it, right, if you mass Muslim immigration, we're going to fucking give you so much of it. You're going to be swimming in that shit. So that's my plan for Canada. I'm going to fuck the country. What I'm going to do is I'm not going to fuck it as much as like the NDP who'd fuck it up the arse. I'm just going to fuck it in the pussy like people normally do. But I'm going to do really well. I'm going to fuck the country so no one else can use it after me. That's, that, sounds, that sounds like a great plan. I mean, uh, it's, it's, it's fantastic that we voted for you. Yeah, yeah. The, well, they said don't do too many interviews, but I, I feel like I've got to start somewhere. Yeah. Well, thanks a lot, Justin. I hope you give uh, millions of dollars of funding to the Dry Shave Show aimlessly as well. I will do. Thanks, mate. Justin Trudeau, everybody.